Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel guys. This is MJ and today this video is all about acrylic pour art. Here I am using an oil brush. So uh, I have chosen a color palette. If you want I'll share this in the description box. You can use the same color palette. Uh, also I am using a, a different size of canvas this time. So you can use your imagination to create a very um, rough idea of the colors where the colors will go and then you can um, use a smudge tool which I will use later to mix them these things up and you can create an abstract background which will look like oil painting and it will look very beautiful you can use this background um, for a calligraphy or for anything you can use it as it is so there's no need uh, to use the background for a specific reason use the same brush which used uh, to paint for smudging this will give this a very beautiful effect also please keep your hand very steady and do not overdo it because if you overdo it it will you know uh, destroy the look when you uh, take uh, very small strokes it will give you a cloud like effect which you can see in the uh, in my screen so like this use as much brush take your time this is digital painting so do not think that it is very easy because you are having um, already presets or uh, already you know brushes so so do not think like that it also needs time because uh, if you give it time it will be very beautiful if you are in hurry or in rush don't do it okay so i have designed this background for my acrylic pour canvas so i'm using a, a two different uh, applications first is infinite painter and the second one is avis paint which i have explained in my previous two videos uh, there you can go and see right now it is looking very rough because I have not smudged everything together I do not want to create a simple background I want a dramatic background that's why I'm doing little little strokes you know I'm just spreading the colors like this okay So it's almost done now i have duplicated my layer and now i'm using um liquefy tool and here i'm using swirl to give it a nice look because i didn't want to i was uh, i like the previous background very much that's why i duplicated it so now here i'm giving the cells i have created this cell brush okay so if you want let me know in the comment section if you want this brush i'll share it with you so i'm using a smudge tool and creating different types of uh, uh, cells at different places uh, also i'm using a smudge tool because it will uh, spread the color and give you the exact feel of the cells now i have opened abyss paint and now i'm using a special brush and um, expand tool to create cells I can create cells in infinite painter because the reason is that it will pixelate it because the lines of the cells are very thin so it works here better just create cells and then you can just um, liquefy them just shift them or if you do not want cells um, this much then you can just leave it it will give you a very beautiful feel so I have done this
so my this painting is almost done you can see it here it is giving me a very beautiful cells effect that's all for today thank you and you can see this this is the beauty of this piece the strokes they are perfect all right so that's all for now bye bye take care of yourself keep painting